Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Here we go. In this video you will see in which direction the price of IOTA has moved recently. Additionally, you will find out what the technical indicators SMA, Stochastic RSI and MACD are predicting about its price and future movements. If you are not familiar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos down below in the description. Looking at the hourly time frame for IOTA, the price rapidly went down with around 4.1% in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 27.3 cents. We can see that the sellers are taking over because the volume was high, showing that this move was strong. Jumping to the hourly simple moving averages, for this time interval, the current price is below all of the simple moving averages, which looks bearish and you should keep an eye on the closest SMA, the 20 SMA will play as resistance or the price will peak above the current price which is around 27.6 cents. Moving to the hourly stochastic RSI, there are no signs of the stochastic RSI being oversold or overbought at this time, but we can see that the trend is currently going down because the K line is below the D line. Jumping to the hourly MACD, seeing as the MACD line is above the signal line, meaning that the trend is currently on the up. However, the MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently shifting to the downside and it could be expected that the price will consolidate and it is better to wait and see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be bearish. Looking at the three hourly simple moving averages, for this time interval, the current price is below all of the simple moving averages, which looks bearish and you should keep an eye on the closest SMA, the 20 SMA will play as resistance or the price will peak above the current price which is around 28.1 cents. Moving to the 3 hourly stochastic RSI, there are no signs of the stochastic RSI being oversold or overbought at this time, but because the percent %K line is over the percent %D line, we can deduce that the trend is currently on the up. Jumping to the 3 hourly MACD, the MACD line is below the signal line, which shows that the current trend is on the downside. The MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently indecisive so consolidation for some time or shifting the momentum could be expected and it is to wait to see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be bullish. In general, the larger time frames have a greater impact on the price, so please remember that when we display different time frames with different indicators. And also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short term trading. Thanks for watching. New videos are uploaded every few hours analyzing various cryptocurrencies, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out. If there is something that you didn't understand, leave us a comment below and we'll get back to you. You should know that trading with cryptocurrencies is very risky and these videos are only an overview of what happens with the price and a pure technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. So you should read more and make your own investing decisions. See you next time.